hello guys let's see how we can connect with a uh, web service via sim 900 module uh, with arduino and how to change uh, the inputs and output according to the uh, web service outputs so what i'm going to use uh, this for this project is uh, one sim 900 module and this arduino you know and uh, you can see uh, three color bulbs and few resistors and some connectors first i'm going to connect a uh, shield with the uh, arduino you know sorry uh, i need to show you this i have inserted a sim and a battery for the uh, sim 900 module um, uh, now i'm going to connect the shield with the arduino you know uh, seems it's okay now uh, and uh, we have to insert the antenna correctly yeah now uh, system is finished uh, our final uh, it's mean the expected result is uh, on and off these three bulb according to the web service output so let's see how the circuit works uh, I'm using red green and blue bulbs uh, connect with uh, port 2 3 and 4 uh, this is a uh, 330 ohm resistors uh, since it's coming with as 5 volts uh, our web, web service is uh, returning uh, some kind of three digit output like one zero one uh, one 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 like so this first digit represent red led and second digit represent green led uh, third digit shows blue led uh, if it is zero mean it's off and if it is one it's on i wrote simple php program and uh, hosted on triple zero web hosting okay i have connected uh, these three bulb uh, with uh, port two three and four and this is the ground wire uh, now i'm going to connect this uh, with the computer and let's see the programming part okay let me explain how uh our small web service works uh, actually i got a free domain name from triple uh, zero web hosting dot com uh, it's uh, sim 900 test dot net 46 dot net um, this is the interface i have developed uh, actually this is a very simple program and uh, i will upload all the codes and uh, for the web service also uh, with this video you can find uh, those uh, in the Dropbox location I have shared um, in this in interface uh, we can provide uh, numbers it means 0 or 1 uh, regarding to the which LED we need to on or no off so as an example I need to uh, on all three colors uh, then I place 1 1 1 1 then I'm going to submit it and you can see it's uh, it shows uh, red is on green is on and blue is on uh, in the api side uh, once we request get state php color all i'm going to refresh this and yes you can see it shows one 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 as i explained before this first digit represent the red and second one represent the green and third one represent the blue color so once uh, our Arduino program it means the sim 900 module request this URL while the GPRS connection it receive this 111 then it convert it to into the uh, digital output uh, one problem here is uh, if you look at the page source 
you can see it has some another text also so we have to do some uh, string operation uh, in the Arduino side uh, those may not related to you guys uh, so you, you guys can skip those things so uh, this, uh, this is the PHP program that I have wrote for explain this uh, scenario so I will explain I will upload this all the uh, PHP code also so and uh, we need to create small uh, actually I have created small uh, table also uh, then uh, let's look at uh, the Arduino program so uh, you can see uh, I have defined LED uh, green blue and uh, red one as two three four uh, then set the set all as outputs here uh, in this time we have to uh, switch on the sim 900 module manually if you need to switch on the sim 900 module automatically uh, refer to my uh, bef before video regarding the sim 900 module so once we uh, this delay is for uh, set up the connection because it gets some time to connect with the uh, tower then uh, it added uh, 30 second 30 second delay then uh, once it reached the loop uh, it start uh, setting the request but uh, setting uh, HTTP request is not a simple thing uh, with the sim 900 module because uh, it's work with the AT command uh, we have to do lot of settings uh, set up before sending the request uh, to the web as you can see uh, we first check the signal quality uh, actually I have added this uh, as information because uh, uh, even this uh, signal quality is low we proceed with uh, proceed uh, forward uh, in this code but uh, it's good uh, consider about the signal quality also uh, first we check the signal quality and then attach the GPRS support uh, and uh, then uh, we set the connection as uh, GPRS uh, actually you you may wonder how these uh, uh, AT commands uh, find and uh, where can we find all the information so you can get uh, this uh, all the AT commands for sim 900 module in this location this is a, uh, coming as a PDF and you can see uh, it shows uh, request and the response and what what it means and what you can do with this uh, request so I will share the location uh, in the comment uh, you can uh, find this uh, PDF file and uh, it will help you a lot uh, just going through uh, with this uh, information and you will find a lot of information other than uh, what I have used here so uh, let's see yeah uh, this is the place uh, what I need to express uh, this is the URL that I got from the triple zero web hosting and uh, this is the request I sent to the server so it I'm sending the color all so it request as I explained a three digit number uh, once uh, it receive a three digit number I call the change LED method so within the change LED method, actually this is a very raw code. Uh, it's uh, this uh, this code is uh, customized. It means uh, with the, your request, you have to write uh, whatever the uh, string logic you need to concatenate, or you have to substring whatever the string you need. In uh, my code, I substring uh, 30 to 31 to get uh, value for red color and uh, 31 to 32 for green color 32 to 33 for blue color and according to that I change the uh, state of the output so that is the program and actually it's a very simple program I have added uh, some uh, serial data printing lines 
to show you how this program goes uh, through step by step and you can see the, these steps uh, printing on the actually the responses uh, of this re this request printing on the serial output let's see uploading this program okay i'm going to upload the code into the arduino you know we can see upload is done uh, so let's see the serial monitor and i'm going to switch on the uh, sim 900 module manually and it's power up and it will wait 30 seconds uh, before setting up the gprs connection uh, let's see yeah you can see uh, it's uh, setting the gprs uh, settings uh, csq uh, quality is 11 and it will it will work now so uh, it sent the request to the sim 900 test.net uh, 46.net uh, and request as all yeah you can see uh, uh, it get result as 0, 1, 1 it's been red is off green is on and blue is on so it uh, continuously sending the request uh, to get the state uh, if you look at uh, the state uh, actually here is uh, let's see uh, refreshing this yeah you can see it shows 0 one one that's that's the output it shows here also so let's see how it works in uh, actually uh, i will uh, move to the camera okay this is the setup and i have wide external power supply uh, to ensure this uh, this has no any connection with the computer and you can uh, uh, see its work without any connection with the computer so i'm going to uh, restart the system and switch on the sim 900 module you can see it's right uh, red color light is uh, on and green bulb is blinking and yeah it's blinking slowly it's mean it connected with the network so in the current state uh, you can see uh, it print red as zero green as one blue as one so these uh, three color bulbs will light up according to the settings now let's see it will get time uh, as you see it uh, it has a lot of settings to setting up before uh, get the data from the web service yeah you can see it's uh, red bulb is off and other two blue and uh, green bulbs are switch on so let's see uh, changing this a bit uh, i'm going to switch on the red one and i'm going to switch off uh, the green one yeah i'm going to submit it yeah now uh, it should uh, ready switch on green in switch off uh, and the blue should be uh, switch on so let's see how these uh, bulbs changing eventually with the uh, next request yeah you can see uh, it changed red is on uh, green is off and uh, blue is on so thank you for watching the video and i have uploaded all the information uh, and the source files also uh, please uh, add a comment or contact me to get if you need any further help uh, just uh, add a comment and i will reply as soon as possible so hope this will help you guys uh, thank you